YouTube, welcome back to our LEGO Harry Potter series that we've got going on here. In this episode, we're going to be doing a few Hogwarts tasks around the castle. We're going to be learning the spell Ridiculous, as well as uh, attending a divination class and doing some monster handling and learning how to fly with Buckbeak. Um, once we've done that, we're going to make our way to Hogsmeade and begin the next level, so let's get straight to it. Alright, so we've got plenty to do in between the previous actual level and the, the next actual level. Um, we've got to learn the Ridiculous spell, uh, we've got to spend some time in the Divination class, we've got to learn how to ride Buckbeak, it's a whole thing. <laughs> One for Hermione. Oh. Two for Hermione. Three for Hermione. All right, Ron, you're up, bro. I wonder why it makes you do it twice. Because you see the, the skates appear originally and then they disappear and you've got to do it again. I wonder why it, uh, it asks you to do it that way. Alright, there we go. It's uh, ridiculous. So what we need to do here in the uh, Defense Against the Dark Arts class. I know that the that there's that Hermione puzzle, we don't need to do that right now. Hey. Uh, thank you. Take this key over to the door and keep on keeping on. Who's this lady? <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna try and get past these vines somehow. That's it? Well, okay. Oh, that was Professor Trelo Trelawney? Trelawney? Mm. Alright, so we just got to put all of these, I guess, teacups on the saucers. Uh, where's the money?
So none of these are terribly time consuming. Um, however, there's quite a few of them and there's running around. Ron's cup was made by the Riddler. I think Nick has forgotten that we're not um, ghosts. Now we should be off to, you know, learn the monster handling, Buckbeak, I believe. What the heck? Casual troll there, okay. Go straight on through. All the familiar places we visited and repaired and touched up on in the previous years. I like that they've kind of held it all together. You even kind of have that noise of like the follow the spiders. Gotta watch out for the Dementors. Here's Hagrid. So we need to get some meat for Buckbeak. I, I just want to call it Bucky from here on. I don't want to get too confused with Old Mate the Winter Soldier, but yeah. I'm a big fan of the wasps. She's got us. Okay. We got our first piece of buckbeak meat. Oh, these little pixies are non stop. Okay. Oh, no, he's going to chase us forever. Come on, Ron, you got this. Classic Ron. Oh, yeah, I can see another one. Take this one back. Hmm. 
We need to get up here somewhere, somehow. Is our third piece. Oh no! Oh no! Jumping over the lily pads will look easier than it is. Alright, this should be everything. Okay, so that's most of pretty much what we needed to do in between the, the two levels. Now we've just got to make our way to the next level. I'm hoping it was this way. I better double check. <laughs> oh no, now I've really messed it up. Okay. Guess we're just gonna go explore a little. Oh, thankfully there he is. So we've got to meet up with, uh... Oh, we've already got Fred and George. Perfect. We just need to find the secret entrance to... Hogsmeade. It's kind of crazy when you think about it, how big this castle actually is. They break it up into numerous different kind of transitions, so it's different areas. Um, but if this were just one straight... Like, area... I think it'd be massive. I'm trying to work out where we're supposed to be going here. Off to the left. That's how big it is. And it's even more interesting because, like, the the castle area, because as you 
kind of advance in the, the year levels, you know, you can access areas that you could see before, um, and you probably, you know, may have tried to get to, but you were unable to. That'll do. Come on. We're so close. There we go. I think we needed our character to be a little bit closer. Just a thousand kilograms. Alright, well, we're pretty much nearly at Hogsmeade here. Oh no, no, no. We'll just change over real quick. It's always interesting to see what everyone's bog art will turn into. Okay. So the first guy's got a big nose, so I reckon he would enjoy the flower. Hey. Hey. The second one has a big mouth, so cake. And that hey. leaves the third one with big eyes for hey. picture. Good job, Fred. Alright. This will bring us up to the, the level Hogsmeade. So that'll conclude the, I guess, the in-between episode between, like, the two proper levels. Um, if you guys have enjoyed this video, subscribe to the channel so you guys can be notified about uh, when we upload next content. And I'll see you guys on the next level. That sentence didn't really make sense, but, you know, subscribe for the effort. See you on the next one. Bye!